Hey, good morning, Jeremy Bates here, Buffalo Modular Homes. It's a beautiful day in the Southern Tier. As you can see, we got loads of snow. If you're a skier, this is your year, um, or snowmobiler. Behind me is the Magnifique. The Magnifique is typically uh, 1585 square feet. This one has a little bump out on the back box, giving it a much larger laundry room, and I'll show you inside. And from a design standpoint, it sort of looks like a breezeway. Uh, I think it looks really nice. We've got a, uh, it's, it's a two car garage, but it's really the size of a three car garage with a very large roof line. And we've got some brick skirting at the front of the garage. We'll also have craftsman columns on the porch with a, a brick stone base to match the garage. Um, we're just waiting for that to come in actually the decking board has been delayed a little bit, so we're waiting for the decking board to go in, that we can finish the columns. This 1620 square foot, three bedroom, two bath, uh, comes in at uh, just a little over 300,000 turnkey with everything included, all of your site work, basement, uh, house finishes, quartz countertops, uh, the works. Really a beautiful home, a great price. Let's do a walkthrough. So this is the hallway coming in from the garage. And off of the hallway is this pretty big utility room. This is kind of a glamour laundry room. That's where the washer and dryer will go. This is a, a laundry sink, utility sink. And really, this is such a great area if you like doing um, some canning. Uh, I know my mom loves doing canning. I love eating the preserves and different things like that. And uh, there's actually an extra back door here out to the backyard. And there's a very large coat closet so you come in from the garage and just off of the just off of the garage is this big closet obviously we've got some tools and things in there right now but uh such a great mud room now if you don't want all of these cabinets we certainly could do lockers and benches and things of that nature but we love a big mud room in the Northeast because you've got coats and boots and all sorts of things. Okay, so here we have bedrooms three and two and then bath two. So I'm gonna go in through here. Let's take a look at bedroom three just so you can get a handle on the size. I've got a single window. This is about 12 by 12, maybe 11 by 12. Better turn my phone off here and I'll show you the closet there. Pretty good sized closet. White six panel doors. And bedroom two is pretty much the same size in this plan. We'll go across to bathroom two here. And you can see we've got single vanity, raised toilet with a grab bar, and we've got this garden tub. And this garden tub is a little bit bigger than a regular tub. I describe this tub as a, you know, a one piece insert tub that's big enough for an adult to take a bath in if they so choose. So, that's only maybe a few hundred dollars to upgrade to that from the regular tub. And then now coming in to the nook and kitchen, I've got this beautiful tray ceiling, all these LED lights, open concept into the living room, triple window in the living room, quartz countertops, hickory cabinets, Butler's Pantry, 
full tile backsplash. Uh, we've got an extra space right here for uh, an extra fridge. That'll be a second fridge. You can see it's it's set up for uh, a water line for an ice maker, and just a just loads of loads of cabinetry, all soft clothes, quartz countertops, tile backsplash. I love these uh, deep sills on your uh, on your windows. So much extra space for for everything. Crown molding, soft clothes. Huge island. This island just goes on for days. You could probably put five or six bar stools there. Now this is the Magnifique plan and the standard Magnifique has the fridge uh, right there. But we moved it over to this, this place here. I like that I like that move in this plan. I think that's a good use of space. You're going to have fridge and then you're going to have range over there. Um, you know, dishwasher right there. And uh, I like that setup. I also, uh, if you do want your fridge right in this position here, I, I like an extra uh, sink here. And you could use that area then for a wet bar. Uh, let me turn that light on here actually. There we go. You can use that area for a wet bar, and um, but it looks fantastic. These hickory cabinets are stellar. LVP flooring. We've got the gooseneck faucet. There we go. That pulls out, I think. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Everything is brand new. Everything's extra tight. All the hinges are are so tight on a new house. Double window over the sink. Look out and see your birds, bird feeders out there. Beautiful backyard. Double bowl. Tilt out tray. Huge drawers. So here's the living room. Here's the front door. Off of the front door, you have a coat closet. And uh, turn that light on there. So you come in from the front door. We've got a, a setup here on the wall for TV, uh, for a TV mount. And you can see it's just wide open concept. LVT hard surface flooring really creates a nice flow in this home. And then off of the living room, we've got the master suite and another TV set up here for a flat screen on the wall. And this is the, the master suite here, walk-in closet. Double vanity here. Oh, let's turn the lights on here. There we go. Serenity shower. Oh, I love the serenity shower. Rainfall shower head, wall shower head, handheld shower head, built in seat, grab bars. Oh, I love that. It's awesome. Toilet nook area. Linen closet. Built-in linen closet. This is linoleum, which actually looks amazing. The standard is linoleum and carpet and most people end up getting linoleum in the bathrooms and carpet in the bedrooms and then upgrading to an LVP flooring like this, this wood flooring or this um, laminate vinyl flooring 
throughout the, the common space so that you've got a nice seamless flow through the, through the common space. And then, uh, so off of the kitchen here, sort of behind the nook is where the, the basement stairs are. So let's go down into the basement. Just a massive basement as usual. We've got our, our well water supply uh, units over here. We've got our sump pail, 200 amp breaker service panel over here. We've got actually a garage in the basement here, uh, a garage door in the basement so that uh, the homeowner can drive their uh, lawn machines in and whatever else they might wanna bring in. Uh, even if it's just for storage, uh, that's just a very nice way to have easy access into the basement if, you're, if your ground allows for it. If your ground allows for a walkout, it's great to do that. And uh, here we've got our furnace unit and water tank. And here's this little bump out area that kind of acts as a breezeway between the, the garage and the house. There's our high efficiency furnace there. And there's our water tank, A.O. Smith. Glass block windows. Just a beautiful, clean, eight foot poured, full basement. Let's go back up. Back upstairs. And that's it, that's the tour. That kitchen is just incredible, what a showstopper. So that's the tour. Hopefully that was of value to you. And we'd love to provide you with a quote for your project. If you have any questions about building, uh, let us know. Uh, reach out to us directly through our website if we can connect with you in regards to your specific project and provide you with a quote. Uh, we can do a factory direct option where we come and erect the modules on your foundation. We can do a turnkey option where we handle everything from A to Z. We pull the permits, we do the whole project all the way up to uh, completion and then we give you the keys and you move in that's a turnkey or we can land somewhere in the middle uh, where we call it a, a partial we just want to connect with you and figure out what it is that you're going to do what it is that we're going to do make sure we're clear on that and uh, then we can provide you with a quote for a project like that we'd love to uh, speak with you feel free to reach out at your convenience thank you for watching god bless and have a great day mm -hmm.